Welcome to uh, another video. I am so excited. I just want to show the drink that I got. I got this from Dutch Bros. I think it's one of their holiday drinks. Merry Mischief Rebel. Today's um, is Thanksgiving and I just wanted to say I'm very thankful for you guys. I'm very grateful for every single person watching my videos. Yeah, so thank you for watching my videos and thank you for taking the time to watch me read and me talk about the books. It's one of the passion of mine and it's like so cool that everyone subscribes to me and like my videos and actually take the time to watch me babble and babble with books so because i don't usually do that in real life unless someone's actually interested rarely people are interested in me talking a lot about books so that's why i started this youtube channel to see if there's others out there in the world who are interested in me talking a lot yeah what are you doing? I'll make an intro. So let's get started on today's video. I'm going to be reading a page for every time I pick up my phone. I see a few people do this and I wanted to have my intake on this. Um, in order to see how many times I pick up my phone, I'm going to go to my settings and then I'm going to go to screen time. It shows you like your whole screen time, like daily average and all of that. Under your daily average, it says see all activity. And then when I scroll down a little bit, it shows pickups and it shows like the date. But I'm going to go to last week to see how many how many times I pick up my phone and that's how many pages I'm going to be reading. And on Tuesday it says November 14, I pick up my phone 109 times. So I have to read 109 pages. morning I started on page 86 and I'm supposed to be reading 109 pages. I'm still 29% of rock paper scissors, Adam and Amelia and a dog. Well inside the, the chapel, the, the church, they're literally kind of the opposite and they've been married for years and like sometimes you grow out of the person to like grow up as an individual. Adam is like, he's like a, a writer and he's always lived in books and his reality is books. So he doesn't really like to like experience real life. But Amelia is like, you need to experience life. Like it's not all about books and writing. And while Adam is successful with his book writing and screenplaying, Amelia is not. So it's, but like there's something going on. I got introduced by a new character. Her name's Robin. So she's like an old lady. She's been there for a long time. And she noticed that Adam and Amelia are there. And she's just trying to take a sneak peek who they are. Someone got locked in the fucking wine thing. So like there's a lot of things going on. I'm only literally 30% of the book. So if that's a lot, the whole rest of the book is going to be a lot. Wait, what? What? I just stopped recording and I was reading a little bit and what the f You can't believe anything in this. Like everything's a lie. I can't believe no one. I can't trust any of you guys. It's like, what, 7 in the morning? I'm not used to it, okay? And I'm not a morning person either until I have my matcha. <laughs> I'm gonna cry and go to bed. I look dead inside. I was crying in the shower. <laughs> I'm not gonna explain that. Okay, so I feel like we should be real for one second. Everyone in this world, including yourself, deserves every single thing you want. Like, nothing less. Okay? Don't let anyone makes, make you lose your spark. No matter how hard no matter how much you love the person, do not lose your spark. Yeah, so the current book I'm reading is... <laughs> I'm, I like how I'm doing this fucking speech, and I'm like, so the, today's book I'm reading... I'm reading uh, Rock, Paper, Scissors by Ashley Feeney. So far, it's okay. And we're going through the past, and we're getting both point of views of Amelia and Adam. Like, Amelia's writing letters, like, which wrote in the past of every anniversary, which is cute, which is cute. Now, like, in the present, their marriage is falling apart. I'm gonna go get some matcha. Yeah, you guys are gonna come along with me because my window is like all white. It's like that, but more white. Oh, I'm gonna see. How do I fix this? Do I just. That completely made it so much worse. What do I do? Y'all, look what they did. Look how cute. The matcha. Mm -hmm. it's supposed to be a book video. But I'm literally talking about my life and complaining. Wednesday, November 15th, I pick up my phone 118 times. So I'm going to be reading 118 pages today. Let's see if I can complete that.
Your shit was Tuesday, right? So yesterday I was supposed to read 109 pages. Did I do that? No. But it's only because after work, so I took a nap. Rock, paper, scissors, I read like 10 pages. But then I was like, I was not feeling the story. So I was like, I want a rom-com. I want a little bit more romance. So then that's when I picked up Icebreaker and I read like up to 36. This is what it looks like. It's cute. Oh, I'm on chapter four on Nathan's point of view. We have Anastasia. She is an ice skater. Nathan, the captain of the hockey team. This is my first college romance and sports romance. I really don't like sports. I mean, I played tennis in high school, but um, I'm not really interested in reading about the sports because so far we're getting the college experience. Something happened. So now um, since they're both like ice related sports, I think someone damaged one of the ice skaters ranks. So they had to share one. So I'm pretty excited. Everyone says this is spicy. I like the writing so far. I have a good feeling with this. I'll put it up here how much I need to read. So those are my updates. Let's see how much I read today. story about my life because i every time i go to a family um event i wear sweatpants and a t-shirt all the time christmas thanksgiving but my mom was like you need to start dressing up yeah so so far i have like two tabs i try to color i don't know if you guys can see looking at her makes me want to be the funniest guy in the room so i could be the only one to make her laugh <laughs> Sunday, November 26th. I haven't updated in the last few days. Anyways, funny story. On Friday, I have read nothing. On Saturday, I actually read a different book. So I actually started reading The Hunger Games. Um, I watched the movies of The Hunger Games when I was like little, but I haven't read any of the books. So this is my first time reading The Hunger Games. I actually um, watched the, the new movie, the, this ballad of songbirds and snakes. It was so amazing, dude. It was so amazing and like everyone on tiktok has these theories and i have i have these theories about everything so i was like i had to read the book because like the book shows so much more like so i started binging this freaking book i stopped reading this book and i'm like okay i'm just gonna read the hunger games now like it has my interest now so like since i kind of know remember what everything that happens in the movies and it shows much more than that and i was like okay this is what i needed so on saturday yesterday oh, i'm on page 81 all that but i'm not gonna say much because i'm gonna do like a whole separate vlog of me reading each of the the books so the last final day was yesterday and yesterday was monday i'll put like the little how many pages i read yesterday was like my successful day but yeah so thank you guys so much for watching this video 